。我真的没有想到说他们会是我们家的一。There is a lot of negativity in our country because of the war, the struggle, the fighting groups,、uh, the economical situation. You are very strong, yeah. No matter how situation is that, still you are looking for a better future. Yemen, 位于阿拉伯半岛的南部，也是阿拉伯最贫穷的国家。过去三个月内，霍乱导致国内接近两千人死亡，超过五十万人受感染，是过去五十年以来全球最严重的疾病大爆发之一的国家。另外，国内南北利益的冲突与政权的交替，导致国内战火连连，民不聊生。今天的彩云心意也门特辑，让我们一起来聆听他们的故事。欢迎收看《彩云心意》，大家好，我是主持人怪兽。大家好，我是彩云。那今天呢，我们呃要跟大家介绍一个，我们算是先小会，就是呃他族的一个国家。对对的一些政治上的一些事情，这样哈。那其实呃，我也想说，就是说，嗯，这次的年会有许多的家人都会在问讲，哎，这一次年会最大的收获是什么呢？那在最对于我个人来讲呢，这一次的年会三，我觉得上帝好像派了一些天使来到我的身边，然后当这些他。这些天使来到我身边之后呢，让我顿时感觉到自己的这一个责任，呃，好像加加大了，然后也觉得自己在这一段时间的坚持是非常的值得的。他们就是我们来自一群来自也门的一家。一些蛮幸运的家人是，那先跟大家介绍一下也门这个国家、嗯。这个国家算是在阿拉伯世界里边，就是最贫穷的一个国家。对对对,对，就是。当然有很多，包括就是之前内战啊、嗯、战争啊，然后尤其是战争留下的后遗症呢，嗯、对，是很大的。对，而且就是我们就是想起了他们在几十年都是在这种内战的这种情况之下生活，然后小朋友都是在这种内战的情况之下长大。我觉得就是所有的内战呢，它一定是有一个矛盾的基础，而这矛盾的基础呢，它一定是逃不了就是人性的一种软弱，人性的一种丑陋的一面。我今天呢，就是希望我们能够用着我们满幸运的力量，为着我们满幸运的家人。我从来也没有想到，我真的没有想到说他们会是我们家的一。一一一个成员，对，当他们来到我面前的时候，他们跟我讲我是来自这个国家的成员，我我自己本身也吓到了，然后我也没有想到说三周年的年会，他们竟然也会出席我们的年会，而且他们是，嗯。就是在很困难的一种情况之下来到我们的年会的，是，嗯，所以刚刚陈云姐有说到呢，就是呃，在一个国家里边有一些就是我们无法控制的这些啊变数呢，是我们无法去影响的，但是呢，有些人却说人定胜天，是，他们靠着他们的毅力、耐力，用着他们的生命，我想这一趟回去呢，他们一定会影响。整个，我我不敢说是阿拉伯世界，至少是他身边的人、嗯，他们的精神，他们的爱。这个时候，我们用一个很感恩的心来欢迎我们来自也门的满星云家人 ，Welcome to Malaysia, get to h a Yeah， 呃、uh, ，今天在现场来了很多，就是刚刚彩云姐所说的，他们长途跋涉，是让他们先分享了。Uh, 对 ，You take how long journey? How many day? Any transport from Yemen to, to Malaysia? Yes.、Um, hello, first in the first place.、Uh, about our journey, it took、uh, around six to seven days.、Uh, most of the journey was、uh, exhausting.、Uh, we took、uh, it took us around three days、uh, riding a bus from、uh, the capital of our country, Sanaa. To reach、uh, the borders between our country and another country is、uh, called Oman. We stayed there for another two days,、uh, waiting for a visa from the other country, the authority of、uh, the other country, to just to allow us to cross the border in order to go to their airport and took a plane to another country, which is Qatar. 
We stayed there for two days and we heard that there are some people who stay there for more than 10 days just waiting for, for allo allowance. Yeah, allowance, just to allow us to get from this place and that place. And the place, even the place where we stayed for two days, it wasn't comfortable at all. It is in a deserted place, uh, isolated from everything, from restaurants, uh, from comfortable places, just staying uh, in very hot places because it is a desert, like uh, I have said before. And uh, thanks God, eventually they allowed us because they said, okay, we will uh, take into account that most of you are women mm -hmm. and uh, we will allow you to go earlier. So mm -hmm. after uh, waiting for two days, they allow us to uh, go to Oman and we spent uh, more an, uh, another uh, one day. After that, we went to the airport, took a plane for uh, 24 hours too because it was a long journey from Oman to Qatar and then from Qatar to Malaysia. Mm -hmm. We stayed even for, uh, in Qatar, I, I think, for uh, another two, uh, two hours, most of our journey. When we get here, uh, unfortunately, we attended the festival very ex exhausting, but we tried to fight even the, the desire to sleep and take rest. We say, no, we take this whole journey, an existing journey, to attend the festival, enjoy and participate with the family from in space. We enjoyed the first day despite the pain and uh, the uncomfort that we have been through and the tiredness. And the next day too, it was exhausting. Most of us didn't went uh, to uh, get up. Mm. Please let us sleep at least for another. No, there is no time. I want to go to the company. That's uh, our reason for being here. Mm. This is the reason uh, behind our uh, struggle to come, to just watch and uh, enjoy with the family of Moon Space. And we try just to hold on together. We try to support each other. Mm. Okay, just one more day. Mm. One more day and we will take rest. And thanks God, uh, everything goes well. Um, we was uh, amazed by what we have seen about Moon Space, about uh, the festival. Everything was uh, very nice and we enjoy it a lot. And we thank you for uh, giving us this opportunity to attend and uh, participate and join you on this uh, festival. Thank you so much. So how many of you all come from Yemen? Uh, from us around 16 or 17 because Six. yes yeah so all successfully come out yeah alhamdulillah thank god yeah. for that so yes, yes. Oh, you first time a uh, travel overseas uh, for me overseas? and my family yes yeah. so uh, how is the situation in your country now actually actually uh, there is a lot of negativity in our country because of the war the struggle the fighting groups uh, the economical situation uh, Honestly, I try to invest in my country, try to find a solution. There is nothing good uh, right now in Yemen. So when somebody just told me there is a good company about uh, called Moon Space, I try. I didn't know that person in the first place. He wasn't a friend of mine or something. Mm -hmm. I just took the name Moon Space to try to search the web about the company, and everything that I found uh, make me uh, really as if I find uh, a window of hope. Okay, this is. Uh, <laughs> Uh, this is what I want. Yes. Uh, this is, uh, and uh, I follow this dream. My son, I told him, I, because he's my only son, I told him about the company. I asked him, what do you think? Mm -hmm. This is good for us, inshallah, and we will travel to Malaysia to attend their festival. So he encouraged me, and we uh, start looking for the leaders, the uplines, to tell us more and more details about mm -hmm. Moon Space. But uh, what I found in the internet was more than enough talking about the honesty of and the strength of the company. That's what uh, convinced me, okay, I'm going to do that. This is the only hope, at least for me, for now. Because I tried all the other alternatives, I find nothing. So I'm very grateful to that uh, opportunity, mm -hmm. very grateful to the leader who bothered herself to try to help the people of Yemen. Okay, come, this is a good company. Just to try, you are not going to lose anything. We lost a lot in Yemen because of the war. Still danger there? Still fighting? Uh, yes, most of no. them. Yes, uh, people from the Arab world yes. and Yemeni themselves, they mm. divided into two groups fighting each other. Uh, we were kind of afraid that uh, each group will think we are spies or something may, may capture us, uh, ask us for information. Yeah, yeah but uh, thanks to God, most of the way, uh, it was very, very long because we didn't uh, go for the right way, just uh, like hiding or something. Mm. So, yeah. Still need to hide now? Uh, Still hiding? Yeah. Still Coming hiding. back, uh, yes, because they changed uh, the way because it wasn't a safe way, the main way. They just go to the mountains. It was very exhausting. Um, keep 
asking God for help, okay, God, when this uh, miserable is going to end. But when we remember we are going to Malaysia, to our dream, this uh, thing comfort us, okay, at least at the end we will find something good, we will mm -hmm. feel happy. I think we have uh, enough energy now to go back and uh, face the same difficulties and danger again. Uh, you are other jobs, there, right? Yeah. Okay. I stopped so teaching uh, for more than five teaching. months. Yes, mm -hmm. and I uh, start looking for another job. I find nothing. How much I, is your salary? How much was the salary uh, teaching there? In Yemen, around one hundred fifty dollar around this per month. month. Yes, mm -hmm. a month. What about you? You are working as a teacher. As yes, teacher yes, also, what? I I looking for the, uh, any job here. Okay, mm. yes, um, because uh, in Yemen uh, there is no j jobs. Mm -hmm. You working in Yemen? Teaching assistant in university. Teaching assistant. Yeah. Uh, in yeah. university. Yeah, yeah. I see. Uh, but now I'm coming to here to study also here in University of Malaya. Uh, yeah, uh, I applied for PhD. I think you are very strong, yeah? No matter how situation is that, still you are looking for a better future. It's not yeah. like, I think some people, they are in a very good environment, very lucky yeah, environment, but they give up with their hope, you know? They have no hope with their life. They give up with uh, what they can do. But I think you are very strong, you know? In that situation, you are still look for a better life. Can I know, what do you hope from one space? What you think? How Mon Space can change your life? Actually, the first reason, to be honest, uh, when I look for uh, information about Mon Space, I admire that uh, the owner of Mon Space was a lady. I read about you. You motivate me a lot. I respect ladies who fight for reaching their goals. I see this is what I want to be. I really want to be like this in the future because uh, it is really difficult for us as a woman in Yemen. Uh, most of the people underestimate us. They say, you are a woman, you can't do anything. I want to prove to, for men in my family, in neighbors, everyone uh, was making fun of me. Are you going to travel to Malaysia? Are you believing that? Uh, do you think you will really reach uh, a place no man can reach before? I said yes, and I will prove it. Reach a place no man can reach, <laughs> but yeah. as a woman can yes. bring people to Are you out. crazy enough to go to, uh, through all those obstacles mm. because of far to reach uh, Malaysia and to see your dream come through? I said it deserves that. What you really feel that uh, Mon Space can change your life and Mon, uh, Yemen's people life? Uh, actually, we heard also the uh, Moon Space, when I read about it, uh, uh, there's a kind of uh, charity uh, project she's doing all around the world. We try to grab this opportunity and we say, why don't we, uh, why can't we get to the uh, data registry line and ask here, okay, we are in uh, going through special circumstances in Yemen. We come in the first uh, place to help ourselves and we are hoping to help our families mm. and by the way, our country, the whole country. He is already 10 years old, right? Yeah. That means he has passed through the, when 2015 started, uh, I mean the yes, war yeah. being um, yeah. uh, started. It was a he, very hard he period for that, us. Right? Yes. So, but we try yeah. to convince each other, okay, uh, because uh, uh, we, in our religion, we just say our God is uh, putting us into an experiment. If mm. we thank God for everything, He will help us. If we just mm. say, why God, why? At the, ve at the beginning, uh, we feel very sorry and terrified about our kids. How are they going to fail? Mm -hmm. We don't want them to be very complicated in the future. And in the first uh, time when they hear a bomb or something, uh, just a scare and yell all the, uh, all the time, not just to him. People at the end, they were prevented mm -hmm. from going outside the room. No way. Mm -hmm. Most of the time they were just staying and sleeping under the stairs because it is the safest place for them. Mm -hmm. Bombing was everywhere in Yemen, especially the first two years. After mm. that, uh, it's slow down, sign, kind yeah. of. Every time they t say, the okay, it will end, the war will be end, we say, thank God, and start again. We don't know when. That's why we we cannot trust the politician that it's going to start. We don't know how long it's going to last. So we are trying to find our own solutions. We are not going to count on anybody, just uh, ourselves, and try to find our own way, mm. our own... Have you yeah. ever think of leaving the country? No. I'm still not thinking about this. Even I like uh, Malaysia, but no, I cannot uh, afford uh, staying away from my family, father and uh, uh, sisters, brothers. I can't uh, live without them, actually. Yes. That's why I took my son. He didn't uh, 
like to stay away from me. Mm. I traveled one time through bus to Saudi Arabia and leave him at home. I was kind of uh, crazy about him. That's why when I took him this time, it was different because of the war. Maybe something bad will happen to me in the way or happen to him at house. We, can, we are not safe anywhere. At our houses, outside the country, we are not safe. That's why I took him here and he said, oh, Mom, whatever happened to you will happen to me. I can't live without you and you can't live without me. I say, that's a good decision. Let's go together and uh, inshallah we are hoping for the best. So how much you spend to come to Malaysia? To Actually, Asia? we put for the account itself around uh, 1,300, but uh, most of us um, don't have salary. Just to try to gather whatever we can just to travel to here. Most of us around uh, try to gather around six hundred dollars just for mm. staying at uh, apartment. Each, each one of us, yeah. One people six hundred. Six hundred, yes, approximately mm. to afford staying here for ten days. It wasn't uh, good for us. Uh, we can't stay, but we said we cannot uh, go through the whole journey again after two days. We have to take rest at least for five for uh, ten days. Then. Go home. Mm. And now we are preparing ourselves for going home. Most of our family are concerned about us. Are you safe? Yes. Nothing happened to you. We say everything is okay. What about the communication like handphone, media, still? Uh, in Yemen, yes, yes, Social internet, media, everything. Like Facebook, That's everything. how we Your try hands. to find about the moon space. Mm. Everything is available. Any rich family in Yemen? Yes, still yes, rich. Still, yeah. still, most mm. of them travel to other countries. They didn't mm. live at. Uh, uh, especially in the first uh, two years, most of the rich family travel they outside travel out. Yemen. Mm. Yeah, but when they say the war is still uh, going for a long time and uh, the situation in Yemen is acceptable, they then prefer they come to back. come come mm. back. Okay. Then, as as we know, Monspace is an e-commerce company. Uh, um, like we have the Monspace Mall is a base, our base mm -hmm. for your journey. Then you can get products from the Monspace Mall mm -hmm. with a special price. And mm -hmm. then when you recruit people, like you have recruited uh, almost 1,000 members mm -hmm. in Yemen, mm -hmm. you will get the rewards, right? And mm -hmm. then can spend the money in Monspace Mall, can get the products from Monspace Mall, right? Mm -hmm. But uh, how, what do you think with the e-commerce, is it can work in your country? Actually, we face lots of difficulties. Uh, mm. E-commerce is uh, even a new, new thing for us. We mm. still need uh, to um, deal with the other person face to face, not yes. through the internet or stuff mm. like this. We said this is the new version of marketing for this mm. century. Most of the people in Yemen, they can't use the internet. This is mm. one of the basic problems. Uh, even there are uh, stuff uh, in our uh, group, they cannot use uh, cell phones, smartphones, what about mm. uh, internet? They just count on other people to help them to do everything for mm. them. Uh, there are also some members like this in my uh, network. I try, okay, I will help you uh, uh, to the extent that I can. But uh, when it goes further and further, we will face more and more difficulties because we need people who knows what th they are doing. Mm. We are still learning. We are new and we are still facing difficulties. But uh, with the help of our leader, yeah. she tried to simplify uh, lots of things for us. Mm. Yeah, this is this is what I uh, care about you all mm -hmm. because I think uh, you make me feel that uh, Monspace uh, play a very important role and also very responsible for this. Mm -hmm. So I want all the Yemen's members, you join one space and you really, really can um, change your life. Yeah, we yeah? hope so. And also can influence other people, as we said, life inspiring life. Yeah. Okay, so now you have to tell all our friends from Yemen, uh, just let them know. We will officially um, appoint that 17 of you all mm -hmm. will represent uh, Mon Space to do a lot of things and help a lot of people in Yemen. So 17 of you are the ambassadors of Mon Space in Yemen. The company, company will uh, come up with a budget with your all suggestion and then 17 of you go back to your country and then you try to do, try to help. See whatever we can do and whatever we can help to those uh, people who need. Yeah. That's one of the greatest news that we have ever heard till now. Very grateful for that. Thank you so much. Yes. yes.